Uh, we do have a Minotaur over there. I need to stay away from... And I can still drop a fighter on my face or keep hovering over, which he probably is going to do because he's probably pissed. <laughs> probably pissed here. Ah, oh, he's way too close. Oh, that's not good. That's definitely not good. Not good. Not good. Minotaur, there he is. Down to 60, we go, can I get a lock onto him? I still need 9 more kills, <laughs> this isn't going well so far. I know we have about 40 minutes left, yeah 40 minutes. Well, at least we got one of the missions done, we got the planes missions done, and the new mission for Dockyard will start Wednesday I believe? So we still have a day tomorrow. Still have one more day. But I do need to have a look at what the uh, progress is and how far we are in. Because I do tend to, I try to make sure I don't, I've done every mission before the next uh, options are open. Because I do want to give it my best to get uh, to get a new ship, but it will be tricky. Let's see, Balau, Sherman, say the Mino. Doable. And there's no point to middle nonsense. Because I probably will not spawn there. And they got a Sherman, don't they? Yeah. Hmm. I want to go straight through mill. That's the shortest route I can get to get over here, because there's usually no one sitting here. Usually not. Preserve my oxygen as long as I can. So I want to make this last as long as possible. But I need to go in periscope depth for that. Because at, at other depths we just go too slow. So I have to get through the A cap without being spotted and without capping, unless Gearing is capping it, then it's fine. Tricky, tricky. Yamato, Montan, Montana, Vincent, Minotaur, Nakimov. I do need to know where their stealth ships are and which one is opposed to us. We do have Balawi, of course. Wait, man. Little swerve. Come on, move along. Move along! Mont is going forward, but slowly. Yamato is going too far to be uh, any help to us against uh, submarines. He's just too far. By the time we get to any good, there's Monty. I'm just going to launch these randomly, straight ahead. Sometimes they randomly hit things, and that's kind of nice. It's unlikely, but... Okay, down we go. Uh, actually... Ah, there he is. Okay, never mind. We can stay up. All forces provide cover for that target. I think that because people don't re usually watch on the main map. But if he bombs there, he should be able to hit that guy. He is, doesn't seem like the guy who tries those things like that, so... Don't expect too much. Four, three, two... One, we're good. Now you want us turning and twisting. There's Sherman, too far to spot us. It's good. And Balau gonna still spot us. Nice, nice. Sherman's getting a little bit closer than I want him to. One more Yamato. There's a Nakimov. Oh, oh. He's stationary, as all yeah, Nekomov saw. And yes, we can launch from this distance. <laughs> we can. <laughs> so we will. He can, of course, turn and twist and activate his engine and do things that are intelligent, but it, it's a carrier player. H how many of them do you think can do things like that?
Okay, we used the oxygen as long as I could. Make it last. You want to sort the first set of torpedoes, but they were not aimed at him. So he's probably going to slow down enough to dodge his second set. Or not. Or not. Okay. Sure. What I said I'm really interested in is this set here. Is there not him of moving? What do you think, Chad? Is he maneuvering? Is he using his engine for power? Also, Sherman's in the cap. Uh, we did kill the Balao, though, so that's kind of nice. We should be about the point where we should hit Nakimov. Should be about here. And there he is. Three hits. <laughs> From that range, yes. Hmm, he's too close for now. But I can't do a lot of damage to him. I need to wait till those planes are over, though. Those planes? I need to wait for those. But I need to wait anyway. Need to wait till what? 3.2? 3 maybe? Because he's reversing, so he gets closer. And we need to get this distance to be 3 kilometers at the very least. Else we do basically no damage. Oh, he does put a plane above me. It is just too far back though, but. 2. Three. Now the planes are hmm, coming back here. Need those to be far enough away. Now. Montana coming in the front. I see him. And the station is awfully close. Well, let's go for this guy first then. That one. And we're going behind Devastation, because I think they want to go this direction, so I want to make sure I'm going in this direction here. And we'll see what those do. He dodged them. Ah, kinda. Still three hits. Three hits is good. We have one minute of auction left. I need to get away from Devastation before it happens. There's also a lot of planes above me. And this is why... Um, Gato is so broken, it's because he doesn't need to ping. He doesn't have a, a, a reason to let himself be spotted anytime. I'm not pinging anything. I'm not showing my location anywhere because the ping torpedoes are awful. The ping range is only six kilometers, which is awful. Torpedoes do only do damage at six, or it can only hit at six kilometers, but they can't hit within three, so yeah. And also go so fast they can't really home in on anything. So all in all, they're just really, really bad. I think we have a chance to get... There's Devastation. Let's get him first with a few back torpedoes. Chase him off. There's a knock him off. There you go. I can't go down anymore. Gonna get spotted because I'm too close to knock him off. Which means I'm gonna get torpedoes in my face. Devastation is far enough away. Not great distance here. And we're gonna be forced up any time now. Seven, eight, nine, six, one. We're invisible. <laughs> so close. Down, those planes are coming close. I don't like him. We got him, we got him, we got him, we got him. 15 seconds, 14. Don't go too close. Ah, he spotted me. First time I spotted is on this part of the map, right here. Uh, we do have a mine hole over there. I need to stay away from. Now the guy can still drop a fighter on my face or keep hovering over, which he probably is going to do because he's probably pissed. <laughs> probably pissed here. Ah, oh, it's way too close. Oh, that's not good. That's definitely not good. Not good. Not good. Minotaur, there he is. Down to 60. We go. Can I get a lock onto him?
Max some depth. There's a lot of planes incoming. We did make a decent turn. And we're good with that. Plane spawn is a problem for every single stealth ship, including this one. We got a hit, we got a hit. <laughs> I don't know why. He can just do side row and stuff, but he doesn't. Apparently. And he's going at four kilometers away from us, not towards us, so he can still get the, all the damage we can do to him. Um, do I want to use my... Yeah, I do want to use my CP here. Yeah, he's, he's trying to drop fights in front of me. I'm trying to get around. There's the Hydro. But I don't have oxygen for this. I need to turn in. I can't turn in, because then he's too close to the torpedoes on him. That actually do damage to him. How are we spotted? What is this? How does this work? That shouldn't be a thing. so much damage. Of course, Hydro will make sure I get spot all the time. I don't have oxygen for this. I do need my team to actually start doing things. I'm keeping these guys distracted. Kill their TV. But I kind of need them to actually do something like this one. Needs to go over there. Don't know why he's not pushing it, but he's not. Make use the island here to help me out. I don't think I live long enough to do so. Uh, he can get close. I cannot turn around to use all my computers on him. I cannot fight back to this. Uh, I'm gonna use this. Maybe we can use Island to get a few seconds. Oh, there's there's a curve has gone. I'm gonna use Island for dodging. I don't think I can get can do it though. No, we cannot. But his hydro is gone, but I don't think he uh, he's going to eat one of those. He knows they're coming. Yeah. So even after his death, the carrier was still a problem, but... We did get to kill him, although my Yamato is absolutely too far back. What the hell are you doing, man? 